So I want to talk about something. I did a live video on Facebook last night, sharing it on YouTube right now. But when I woke up this morning, I seen this article. Dr. Strange Director says Christians are not the solution, but the core problem in America. Now, if you know, uh, you know, you follow me on Facebook. I know some of you only follow me here on YouTube. You don't know that I have a Facebook page is actually where most of my followers and the growth of my ministry has come from. I've been saying before the election when I was in South Korea that there's going to come a time where they demonize Christianity, they're going to look for reasons to uh, blame Christianity, and they're going to use people who claim to be Christians to strategically, uh, politically correctly, and systematically uh, pass legislation to attack believers. But first, what they have to do is slowly but surely begin to demonize Christianity. And so um, I shared the article uh, with CNN. And uh, Mike Pence, you know, his wife going to the Christian school where, you know, they have certain rules for you to, you know, attend that school and stuff. And CNN began to bash the Christian viewpoint. And they said, you know, oh, this is so disgusting. This is so terrible. Then we seen the pastor uh, lose his job for putting a sign out in front of his church saying homosexuality is still a sin. Uh, I've many times talked about how the LGBTQ community is going to start looking like how the black community was in the 1960s. And they're going to look at Christians as like, you know, the evil white people who was uh, for segregation and stuff. It's going to become a human's human rights kind of thing. So if you speak against, you know, homosexuality, if you speak against, you know, gender fluidity, if you speak against, you know, men using women's bathrooms, you're going to be labeled as an evil, disgusting person. And of course, you know that if you speak and stand for these things, you're speaking and standing up for the word of God. Now, check this out. This is the funny way they do it. <coughs> Despite being a Christian himself, Hollywood director Scott Durkinson isn't happy with American Christianity. Then he goes on to say all of these things. But the key wording that um, I want to want to see want you to see is that he says Christians are the nation's core problem, and we see. That this is the narrative that a lot of people are beginning to paint. This is like the second article that I've seen just today where people, you know, oh, Christians are the one. I told you Christians are the one that elected Trump and Christians are the one that put him in office. And Trump is just the worst president ever. And no matter how bad he is, you know, over 75 percent of white Christian evangelicals are still supporting him. They're wrong. They're stupid. They're dumb. They're going to drive this country into the ground. We've got to do something about about these Christians. And then, of course, the enemy strategically, like I said in the last video, um, you know, the first black president happened to be the president who pushed the LGBT. Q agenda. So people are conflicted about that. Well, I can't really say nothing bad about him. He was the first black president. I'm black culture over kingdom. There's division, there's confusion. Instead of doing what's best for the body of Christ, people are individuals. Well, I need to vote for, you know, what's best for Hispanics, best for whites, best for blacks and all that kind of stuff. And it's all part of the enemy strategy. While the rest of the world is uniting, you know, we continue to be divided in the body of Christ. You better pay attention. I've been saying this was going to happen. I see it just like, it's kind of like it's just raising up its head slowly but surely. And it's kind of looking around and testing the waters. You know, Christians are Christians are bigots and Christians have these prejudiced views and they, they're so disgusting. Man, the, the, the language is out there, man. So what do you think is going to happen next? People are going to try to get in power and continue to pass, you know, laws persecuting Christian businesses, dictating what a pastor can preach about, it's coming. Better wake up, better pay attention.